Ted Sarandos, co-CEO at Netflix, has decided to defend Dave Chappelle and the backlash uh, in regards to his stand-up called The Closer. And he made a statement recently where he addressed it, stating, quote, As with our other talent, we work hard to support their creative freedom, even though this means there will always be content on Netflix some believe is harmful, end quote. Now, of course he should be defending Dave Chappelle and his stand-up. I mean, this is the same guy who defended that child porn by the name of Cuties, which is still on its platform. And the controversial titles that the mainstream promoted about Cuties was saying it was hypersexualization of children. They just called it hypersexualization of children. That's the narrative that the mainstream media was running with it when addressing this controversy. Instead of calling it what it was, it's fucking pedophilia. Cuties, the auditions for it, are pedophile videos, 600 plus of them, that's now available online somewhere. And the movie itself was a soft core pedophile movie that he stood behind. And that all of these employees that wanted to walk out, all of those employees, they didn't walk out about that because they have no issue with the sexual perversions and the sexual predatory actions towards children because they endorse pedal wood and mainstreaming pedophilia. So Ted Sarandos defending Dave Chappelle, to me, it's not some giant treat. It's the least that he can do. But as far as Netflix is concerned, it's still to hell with Netflix. Piece of shit platform. Housing pedo movies. And to hell with all of their employees. Who have this selective offense over bullshit. You know, I hope this Dave Chappelle stand up really makes them mad. Maybe they can get in a warm bathtub and cut themselves over it. Fucking lunatics. This is why I say all the time, the alphabet sex cult and their little insidious agenda, which is connected to the mainstream Hollywood agenda. Everyone should not only be saying the words that Chappelle said, but they should be saying it not as a joke and not during a stand-up, but during a protest or just actively boycotting this bullshit because it's widespread. That's why I say they have no right to critique anyone or to be offended by anything as long as they continue to be the industry that they are, which was exposed with that documentary called The Open Secret. And the people who made that documentary are currently active on Twitter. So you should follow their Twitter because they're still on the ball exposing uh, pedophilia and just how often pedophiles get slaps on the wrist and protected. Now, there are some cases where they suffer the consequences that they deserve, but in so many cases, far too many, it gets ignored, it's just a slap on the wrist, and more often than not, it involves someone of the mainstream, whether it be of the entertainment industry or whether it be uh, within politics. And for me, it doesn't matter the party or the talking points that they utilize, whether they sound good to me or not. A pedo should be done with. No matter what things that they have said 
or claim that they support, they should be done with. But for some people, you know, it's optional. <laughs> and clearly, it's like that when it comes to these Netflix employees who only chose to react to Dave Chappelle's stand-up and didn't choose to react at all with Netflix cuties. So, keep being mad, you fucking lunatics.